Hello everyone, now let's talk about unvalidated redirects. So unvalidated redirects vulnerabilities are one of the most popular vulnerabilities and are often found in a lot of web applications. So before going further, let's talk about redirects. So what are redirects? So redirects takes users from one web page to another web page or sometimes from one web application to another web application. So sometimes it's necessary to redirect user from one web page to another example is login pages. So these kind of vulnerabilities are often found on e-commerce websites where redirection occurs while the time of payment or while checkout. Example, we purchased one thing and if we want to pay the money, so we can abuse the functionality of unvalidated redirects. So now let's see how unvalidated redirects works. Now let's see that how unvalidated redirects work. And here you can see that right now I'm on OS Mutiday web application. Let's go here, OS 2013. And in the last, you will see a section of unvalidated redirects and forwards. So let me just open the first page credit. Okay. So right now you can see that we are on this page credits. And on this page, you will see a lot of hyperlinks. So as I told you earlier that in unvalidated redirect vulnerability, what is our goal? Our goal is actually to redirect the user to some another website. So just for example, if I just copy this link and if I just open this link, you will see that we, we just get redirected to a particular website, which is just mentioned in this hyperlink. You can see here. So let me just go back and let me just paste this link. So if, if we read this link carefully, so here you will see that it's accepting an, another parameter called as forward URL. And here is the URL to which we just gets redirected if we just click on that link. So our main goal of unvalidated redirects is to try to redirect the user to some different website. Now just for example, if I just write here tutorialspoint.com and now if I just hit enter and if I'm just able to redirect to tutorialspoint.com which means this link is unvalidated redirects vulnerable and this web application is unvalidated redirects vulnerable and here you can see that here we are successfully able to redirect user to some another website. So this is because of a poor user sanitized input and there is no database check for this redirection. So in this video we have covered that what is unvalidated redirects vulnerability and how a normal unvalidated redirect works. So thanks for watching this video.